During our research into sexual abuse on the Fenlays plantations, one name came up more than any other, John Chebochok. Chebochok has 400 employees working directly under him. The undercover investigator, Katie, arranges to meet him about a job. Hello? The address for her job interview turns out to be a hotel. Members of the production team are stationed nearby as Katie arrives. Chebochok tells her to follow him into one of the rooms. You really want a job? No, I hope you're going to be this then he stands up and grabs Katie. Considering this is a job interview, Chebochok has already crossed several lines with Katie, but she perseveres. I needed to get tangible evidence that he wanted me to have sex with him in return for work. He said that he had booked a room for us to sleep together, so that needed to happen and not work conversations. I was so scared and so shocked. It must be really difficult for the women who work under Chebocho because he's a sex pest. Chebocho tells Katie, theirs can be an ongoing arrangement. And as you progress, down a mile, down a better, better chances. So, you keep it Katie refuses once more. Mm. As Chebochok opens the door to leave, he spots a member of the production team keeping watch nearby. <laughs> Her cover almost blown, Katie has to think on her feet. The production team calls Katie, using a prearranged excuse to help her leave. But Chebochok remains suspicious. Mkubwa anataka kukuona. Baduma anauma anataka tena uwendo ulale na eno umefanya kazi lumi. 